entire Outlay district. Um, it's an absolutely glorious day. It is 17 and a half degrees and it's the 11th of November, so it's going to be a hot one. So me and the pooch are headed up to some crags. I've not got any water with us because there's plenty up there. I'm going to filter some and we're going to do some sausage and mash and basically have a few drinks and a party for one woman and our dog. Come on! wasn't forecast either. It was supposed to be blown 50. So you can imagine I've got the rab socks and everything in there. Full winter kit. It's nearly 18 degrees. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> but I'm starting to feel the gusts of that wind that was predicted. I think I've just been on the sort of lee side of these hills. Um, so we'll see what it's like when I get up at I might have to um, sack the crags off because it was predicted 45 steady 45 50 doesn't feel like that here obviously um but by the looks of things it might be up there i mean push comes to shove it's going to be a nice night to return nice and chilled cook some food water on tap happy days never thought i'd camp at angleton but there's a time for everything simply because it's so popular or because it's not beautiful, because it is. This is where I am currently. Eh? Please fill over there. Beauty. Lovely and winter. So yeah, I'll crack on, get up there, get set up. Bring us back. Right, son. So I've been up to where I wanted to be, which is up there, and it's absolutely blown a hole. It's really, really protected down here. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pitch here. You kind of complain. I've got the place to myself. It's absolutely beautiful. It is mind. Little private little beach. Dogs in his element. Hopefully I got a nice, some nice colours in the sky. Sky. Sky even, you know what I mean. <laughs> anyway, I'll get this done. stayed here. <laughs> I'd have been getting battered now. Literally blown to bits. I wouldn't have been as happy if there was anyone else here though. Right down the social care. <clears throat> Plus I do a job. Um, I work with very, very dangerous people. So I know who's out there. Anyway, I'm off. I'm off work at the minute, so we'll stop talking about that. <laughs> Look at that.
He always gets really excited when he says he's bad. <laughs> oh, now he's necking his bollocks. Lovely. Thanks, son. Just spoil my video. It's fine. Thanks, you. It's the dog's dinner. <laughs> he's got fridge readers and he's also got some sausages that he's going to share with me later. It's cosy. We're going to have some sausages and mash and peas and gravy. Sunset's died down now. That peaceful. Just having a beverage. Chaz. Chaz. Cozy wozy in the tent. Um got no music on out. Um <laughs> didn't download now because I didn't think I'd be in a situation where I had no signal. So I think I'm gonna be bored a bit. I can hear some ducks quacking. So I could probably sort of do something with that, like sort of <laughs> I'm going to cut my tea and I'm going to see how the land lies then. <laughs> I might just have an early night. I might just get rad arsed. It's an option. Anyway, right, can we shut up? If anyone is familiar with the soya mini squeeze, you will know that filtering is painfully slow. So currently I am filtering water to go with my sausages and it's for mash Idaho Idaho and some gravy it's gonna be yummy like can't wait I'm starving there's the piece in with the sausages just waiting for a bit of a boil before I put the, the gravy in I'm gonna do the Mash separate. Mm, can't wait for this. There's the dogs. Cooling down. Lovely and thick. Just need to do the mash. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I don't know if you can see that, but we now have sausages, gravy and mash. Yum yum. Oh my god. It looks shite, but it's, uh, <laughs> it's absolutely gorgeous. It really is. It's like cheesy mash as well. Mm. Oh wow, I'm so happy with that. Oh, lovely. Well, it's not much else to say tonight. Um, we've had what tea. Um, it's Kylo. We're chilling. Um, I've got no internet, so I can't listen to any music or anything. Um, so I'm just going to chill out. If you don't hear it from us, um, I'll see you in the morning. Well, good morning. It's um, just gone seven. I've already been to see 
Well, check out what I thought was an inversion across there, but it wasn't. There's already been two people up there about 20 minutes ago in the dark. We had us. <laughs> I just can't see the point. And, well, I suppose if, he's doing it, if they're doing a long hike, if they're just coming up to the top and I'm back, if he hiked up in the dark, that's a gorgon away. I don't know, I'm rambling now. Um, so I'm going to go and make up a cup of coffee. Give the doggies breakfast. And head down. Kylo when he's breakfast. Just Kylo when he's breakfast. <laughs> It's knee fry up like <laughs> absolutely clamming. I'm gonna have to get some food and I'll get down there. Motivation to pack a tent up, I reckon. <laughs> Come down here to have me me coffee. This Raji, we start eating everything in sight. What's the matter with you, man? Hey. <laughs> right, that's me and the boy ready for the off. We've had a lush night, um, dead chilled out for about twelve hours. Kip as well. Um, that's where we were. I've picked up a few bits of rubbish that other arseholes left behind, so I'm taking that down for them. Um, but other other than that, uh, it's pretty clean considering it's such a popular spot. So yeah, thanks very much for watching. See you next time. How are you then, son? Let's go.